something a little different for you guys today. What do we got, Carlos? Well, it's uh, your helicopter. Well, I don't even know what brand it is. It's a Tron Dynamic or Dynamic. Oh, cool. Um, 700 size, 6S setup. I'm super nervous. I can't fly helicopters very well, and I shake <laughs> like a what about, mofo. What about this radio? <laughs> <laughs> Uh, yeah, this is something different too, I guess. It's a Radio Master T16S. It feels really good. Yeah, it's cool. Um, a lot of guys, I know a lot of guys that watch our channel do Open TX and Edge TX, so they'll be familiar, right? But yeah. I got this specifically for this helicopter. Oh, cool. And I got a Nexus uh, fly barless unit, which kind of integrates well with, with this. This radio. Yeah, that's kind of why I got both those things I got yeah. them together and then the the heli is the combo pack so it came with KST servos and uh, motor speed control uh, hobby wing speed control yeah and all that stuff that's good all right, all right. I, I would recommend uh, standing behind me probably yeah <laughs> yeah off to the side all right uh, pretty low head speeds too I think 1200 1450 and 1600 in idle up three. So here we go. I don't know what any of that means. Yeah, I don't either. But I'm sure there's some heli nerds out there. <laughs> All right, don't judge me by my flying skills, please. <laughs> All right, here we go. Let's see. Okay. Here we go. That was a weird takeoff. I don't think I let it. Uh... I don't think I let it uh, spool up. You know. Oh my! Uh, my uh, my pitch was too high when it was spooling up. Probably. Oh okay. Yeah. Well, you can fly scale helicopter for sure. Yeah, yeah. Those are pretty cool. If you want to spend a lot of money on something. Uh, I'd rather not. Like a turbine. A turbine scale heli, that'd be dope. Yeah, like an airwolf? Yeah. Yeah, you'd win some of those competitions. An Apache? Yeah, look at those turns. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna go higher, uh, higher the speed. There we go, now we're cooking. This is basically all I do is fly <laughs> back and forth. Well, that's what powered guys do anyway, so. Yeah. I mean, on the simulator, I can do all kinds of stuff, but <laughs> it doesn't really translate to. Uh, well, um, you could probably do it in live, but obviously, this is eighteen hundred dollar mistake. So. <laughs> yeah, but so is a glider, right? Yeah, but I mean, <clears throat> things can go wrong here right away. Yeah, very quickly. There's no. Here's what you do: is you put a higher, higher angle joiner on the, <laughs> on the props. Oh yeah, dude, they're too flat. The blades yeah. are definitely flat, dude. Then you can do some thermaling with the heli. I don't have a camber mode set up. No camber? No. What about camber two? No. I don't have that either. <laughs> Butler's gonna be angry. Yeah. <laughs> Well, it looks good. Yeah, it flies really good. I mean, I know nothing about helicopters. Yeah, the fact that you can even keep it up. But, I mean, it it's a... Uh, it's kind of tame, you know? It flies like a little sweet. Like, yeah. It's kind of quiet. I thought it would be noisier. Oh, because it's the low head speed. Oh. Because like usually these things are 12s, you know, like high voltage. It's, yeah. It's a yeah. That's really the reason I bought it. It's like easier on batteries, you know. Yeah. Also like financially and stuff, you know. Yeah. Well, you're not a heli pro. No. I'm not. Oops. <laughs> Pulling, uh, pulling pitch when I roll. I think I think the key to this is uh, real uh, tight uh, stick springs or stick tension, right? Probably.
I definitely put like elevator inputs when I put the roll in. Yeah, that's easy to do. It's like a flying a barrel roll. Yeah. Try a. That's better. <laughs> That's pretty cool. Not bad though, I mean, I'm fucking shaking like crazy. But whatever. It's something different. I think it's good to do different things. You know, don't always have to fly gliders. This thing go probably like seven minutes. Seven minutes? Yeah, I'm only gonna fly for about five, but I think you could get like seven minute runtime out of this. And uh, for my mild flying, nothing really gets warm or hot, hot or anything like that. Yeah, yeah, you're not stressing it heavy duty. Yeah, if I do a flight like this and I land at like five minutes, I have like 60% battery left. Oh, cool. Yeah. That's efficient, yeah. Yeah. So I'm gonna switch into the lower head speed. Maybe I'd learn how to fly it inverted and do some mowing. <laughs> yeah, you that can. would be cool. Yeah. Nice. Definitely a scale flyer. <laughs> I'm, I'm a. Uh... You're a, a, a nervous flyer. <laughs> <laughs> well, you're probably as nervous as the real pilots are. Yeah, I don't know. But... Jeez. <laughs> Dang, Ollie, lay off the booze. <laughs> I did have some beers last night. Oh, that explains so, it. Yeah. All right. Well, that's about it. There you see my uh, my crazy helicopter skills, guys. Nice. <laughs> He's officially a heli nerd, guys. <laughs> heli nerd. <laughs>